let, let's move to Ethereum. This is what I wanted to cover with you guys last. Um, and let's go with a little bit bigger chart, maybe a two week chart. There we go. So I think Ethereum is headed here, either there at 32 or here at 35 and potentially even up to here. But that's got to play a lot of catch up. But here and here, I don't think is any problem. If I had to guess, I'd go with 3,600, okay? Why? Let's do this, let's draw this in. Okay. And actually, you know what? Let's do this with the with the trend line as well. Make it better. There we go. Now you can see your pattern here. This is typically, by the way, a bearish pattern, but it can be bullish. And in this case, it was bullish. And you've now gotten the breakout. You got a nice breakout, a nice retest, and going higher. Measure your pattern, takes you right up here to 4,600. Look, I already have targets of 15, 16K on Ethereum for this bull market. And you can kind of see that in the chart. Okay. If all we do here is measure the top to top, and I've actually got this, blow this up for you to see. I've actually got this coming through here, not at the top of the wick, but through here and through here. Why? You want as many touch points as you can on a trend line. So there's only one here. This gives you two more, that's three. This gives you three more. That's six, so six touch points for that trend line, okay? If we go straight up on this week's candle, we're at $9,800. That's not gonna happen. But if we go out here to, let's just call it, let's just go middle of the road, June of 2025, we're at 15,000, okay? So I have targets in place for Ethereum on 15, 15K. If we were to get uh, up here in the 36, 4,000 range, anywhere in here, and I get an opportunity to sell my Ethereum, Bitcoin's hitting 60, 62, and it feels like there's an actual real correction coming, I think Bitcoin will correct down to 47-ish, 48-ish, okay? That's that's not abnormal for Bitcoin to correct 15,000 off of 60,000 or 62,000 down to 46, 47. That's not abnormal. How far do you think Ethereum would correct, right? So if we get up here, see this 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 is what this is how my brain works a little bit. Now now keep in mind Ethereum as an investment is a premium investment. Okay, let's take the middle of the road there, 4,200. And let's go from there up to the 16K. Good afternoon, it's Crypto J here from the Bitcoin Academy. And I just wanted to take a minute to invite you guys over to our private community at www.cryptoj.net. Folks, we've been building our private community for about seven years. We've had very few people ever leave the community. I think the proof is always in the pudding. And folks, we've made easily as a team over a billion dollars. I remember one specific trade. We took $390 million out of a single trade as a team. And guys, we're having a lot of fun. We've got people that are free. They're buying new houses. They're buying new cars. Their kids' education is paid for. Come join us. We're having a blast. All we're missing is you guys. Come join us. Sorry, I got to pull the chart down. Okay, 16K. So if I were to get out at, say, 4,200 as an average price, two, 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 
two, uh, almost three X. We'll, we'll give it three X. We'll give it three X. There's almost three X left in that chart. Almost three X. But I could take that Ethereum money. Okay, so if it gets to the 442, we know it's going to pull back. Where's it going to pull back to? I don't know. It's going to pull back somewhere. But let's take another quality asset like Cardano. This, this is where my thinking is, guys. Ada, sorry. Got to get my thinking right, don't I? Let's say that, uh, let me get rid of all this. Okay, let's say this Cardano makes it to a dollar twenty-five in the same time period. Same time period, right? It's going to also pull back a little. So it, let's say it does one of these and hits that, right? Puts in another inverted head and shoulder. Okay, just like this. Okay, so when it pulls back, where is it pulling back to? It's pulling back to 80 cents. All right, if I've just sold my Ethereum, which is a great position to just hold. Like I said, it's a premium asset. It's a premium, premium asset. And I believe that if Ethereum's going to 16, I certainly believe that, 16,000 by the way, I certainly believe six, seven dollars, even eight dollars is in the cards for Cardano. Why couldn't I take my money out of a premium asset, move it over to another premium asset, and go instead of for, we'll keep it light, $6.50, instead of going for a 2.83x, I go for a 6.95. So instead of getting a 3x, I get a 7x. I can. And that's what I'm thinking about on Ethereum.